right on, Wilbur. And the major prize on Plucky Duck tonight is a Toyota Corolla 5-door CS from Ken Morgan Toyota. And here's Ken now to show us the car in his beautiful garden at his Moravan dealership. Come on, Ken, enough of the flowers. Give us a look at the Corolla and what a car it is. A luxurious interior with superb attention to detail. A super responsive 1.6-liter engine. And the five-door hatch allows plenty of room for pot plants or anything else you want to put in it. A great prize, valued at $17,155, flowers not included, and it could be yours on Pluck a Duck from Ken Morgan Toyota, Robin and Nana Wadding, Victoria's biggest dealer. And now, oh, and also, oh dear, it's a new segment, from Commodore, Australia's top-selling computer and Amiga 500, home computer and software system, or you could win... You could be taken to the idyllic South Pacifica's only P&O sitmark and do enjoy exciting shipboard life and exotic ports on board Fairstar the Punch Ship. Or a high performance air conditioner from Carrier, the quiet lion who can keep you warm or cool, your carrier man can. Or go whitewater rafting for six days with Peregrine Adventures and Australian Airlines. Or a fine soft leather jacket from Eric Planensick with the traditional standard of quality he's famous for. And now, Daryl and Jackie pluck some ducks. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but the prize read was so long we didn't have time for the figure. Thank you and good night, everyone. That was Pluck and Duck. <laughs> no, no, hang on, that's... That is incredibly long. I mean, all the prizes. Yeah, we have to go through that every week. Well, let's face it. At least we've got huge prizes. Gee, I hope if you're watching at home, I hope you've got it knitting. Listen, um, we are using someone from our audience. In the first time we played, this is called Pluck a Duck. It, it, it's actually replacing Chook Lotto. Thank heavens for that. And I can hear all the people at home going, oh. But there's a reason, because Chook Lotto was originally put on for three weeks. It lasted four or five years. Right. <laughs> so with any luck, we'll get four or five years out of this if the show's still on. Oh, my. But we are oh, using we are someone hungry. from the audience this week to play Pluck a Duck. And should, you've got to pull one out for next week, We Greg. pull one out for next week, and we'll have the contestant in here live next week. Do you think they could get a shorter barrel? Um, it would be... Uh, there's like a lot of... And if you're wondering where we got this mail for Pluck a Duck, it's the old Chocolato mail, so... Okay, here, I've got a big one. Okay. Okay, it's Deborah Walcon from North Rockhampton. Oh, of course, we... Oh. <laughs> Okay, we don't <laughs> we don't save on an airfare, but no, um, Deborah walk on from North Rockhampton. All those be... rocky heights will be delightful. Yes, what a shame we only fly them down one way. They'll uh... oh, she can give oh. it back. That's right. So let's get rid of this barrel now. Uh, I'll get the contestant. Oh. Um, okay, you, you get want the, the contestant. Please, please. Now the uh, the simplest way to explain pluck a duck is to play it, not explain it, just play it. And our first contestant, would you give a welcome to... Julie McLennan. Julie. Julie McLennan. You've got your fan club still with the recreation crowd. And if people would like to uh, to go along to recreation, where can they go to? Oh, in High Street Armadale. High Street Armadale. See, a quick plug in there, just like that, isn't it? Aren't we, aren't we nice? First show back. What do you do for a crust? You don't work there at Recreation. No. What not. do you do for a living? I've got two children. You've got two children? Yeah. And uh, do, you, do you, so, your home duties? That's right. And what does hubby do? He's an accountant. An accountant? Yeah. Oh, good. Well, you can add up what your prize is worth. Accountant, um, too, from the sounds of things as well. This is a normal wheel I, I, behind I you. I tell you, Daggy, if it yeah. lands on a blue one, the prizes are over 2,000. Right. The, the, they're all colour coded, see? Yeah. The, the, we'll just step aside, we'll take a shot of this wheel. The red ones, the red ones are a really good prize. They're 1,000 to 2,000. That's not bad. And the yellow ones are 500 to 1,000 dollars. And the green ones are extremely yucko. They booby are the booby prizes. prizes. All right, that's fair enough. Worth uh, nothing. Yes, and you'll notice the duck feet up the top here uh, <laughs> when you spin the wheel. So if you'd like to spin it from that side, uh, Julie, give, give it a big, big uh, spin. We haven't tested this wheel. We hope the prizes don't fall off as you do it. But good luck. Bizarre. It's, uh, well, hang on. Now, um, which one do I go off? Um, uh, it's, it's a liner on that one, but it's actually on 23. We take 23. We will. It's on 23. What okay. is no number 23? You up in the middle. You have won a Cambrook package from their cordless range. That means okay. you can do the ironing without plugging right. it in. It's obviously a range of Cambrook... Yeah, you uh, can do it without plugging it in. ...appliances and things. Mm. Right. But it doesn't stop here. Julie, you are our first contestant. And we ask you now whether you would like to keep the Cambrook range or as our crew will sing out as we, uh, we pull it in. Would you like to pluck a duck? You can, you can keep the, um, you can keep the uh, Cambrook range or we can turn it right over like that. Here we are. You can keep the, um, 
Pamela Branch, if you if you wish, or you can. Um, or, thank you. Over there. Uh, thank you. Thank you, boys. I think we've overdone the quacking. Uh, Julie, now you choose to pluck a duck. What we have here are 24 ducks, each with a number that corresponds to the numbers on the wheel. Now you have the Cambrook Prize. It landed on number 23. You can pluck any duck you like and you may win one of the other big prizes on the wheel or, or you might like to go home now with the Canberra package but let me say if you choose to pluck a duck you forfeit your prize if you choose to pluck a duck you forfeit your prize now all would the you like... ducks have been sedated for television by the way yes. <laughs> but, and remember that there's still the car there's still all these other wonderful wonderful big I'll prizes pluck a duck. What but do you there mean, are three duty prizes pluck a duck. would you like to pluck a duck would you like to keep the camera what do you think, audience? I think they said plug it up. Um, so, all right. Now, would you nominate? You nominate you pull out the head feather. The head feather. This week, next week, it'll be a tail feather. Uh, yes, while we're moving, you, your choice of duck. Oh, isn't it exciting? Oh, boy! There it is, and the number is inside. What number is it? Number it's four. number four. Number the four. corresponding number, John. Number four. All right, all right. I haven't got a bloody computer up you've here. Forfeited, <laughs> I get, you've forfeited the Canberra Prize, and now you've got... Yes, congratulations. You're going to be taking to the idyllic South Pacific as only p and r sit, Mark, and do. You want a big one? Yes! Enjoy the exciting shipboard life as you cruise from one exotic wow. port to the next. Join us now on Fairstar. Oh, you didn't even rig it. <laughs> <Bomb ship. laughs> Isn't that fantastic? Our first time, this is more successful than the first time we did the uh, the golden shop thing we did. Balls up, yeah. yeah that, that only lasted a week. This could get two weeks out of this time, I reckon it's great. Are you happy? You've won a cruise. You can take all the members of the gym with you. Uh, well, no, probably just one other person. Julie, thanks for being on uh, our first Plucker Duck contestant and all through the rest of your life you'll be able to say that. No one else can. I know. It, <laughs> no? We don't care. If you'd like to be on Plucker Duck, John! Yeah, thank you, Daryl. Yes, it's pretty complicated. You put your name and address on the back of an envelope and your phone number. And send it into Pluck a Duck, Post Office Box 333, Richmond 3121. That's Plucker Duck.